Take a look at these three videos. Jai Sri Ram, greetings to all. Friends, I'm here just to ask about the work accounted for. Sarya ne mera Jai Sri Ram. दोस्तों मैं सिर्फ काम का हिसाब लेना आया हूँ बधाई हो आप सभी को क्योंकि अभी अभी नागरिकता संशोधन बिल राज्यसभा से भी पास हो गया Only one of them is real. Were you able to tell which one is real? This third video is the real one. The other two are deep fakes. Parsi, Christian, इनके साथ जो अत्याचार हुआ बहुत A term that combines deep learning with the word fake. Deep fakes can be in the form of an image, an audio clip or a video. With deep fakes, seeing is no longer believing. Is anything more sad and lame, contemptible, beneath disdain, in short, provoking of disgust than being Imagine a deep fake of the Prime Minister of India saying 2000 rupee notes are no longer valid currency or a fake sting video. or a sex tape of a politician it is no exaggeration to say that deep fakes could even start a war over the last few years deep fakes technology has rapidly advanced but the technology to detect deep fakes is still catching up experts we spoke to say it is becoming easier and cheaper to create convincing deep fakes deep fakes are already being used in the pornography industry Their spillover into the mainstream is worrying. Earlier this week, Vice reported that the BJP had created an AI-generated video of Manoj Tiwari ahead of the Delhi elections. This video was made with the help of a company called Ideas Factory, a political communications firm. The firm used a lip-sync deepfake algorithm and trained it with speeches of Tiwari to mimic basic mouth shapes. The firm then hired a dubbing artist to impersonate his voice. Now, Ideas Factory called it a positive campaign. But positive campaign or not, the BJP has opened, you know, the proverbial Pandora's box. Remember, this is an example of a deep fake that we know of. Imagine when political parties start outsourcing malicious deep fakes to their proxies and supporters. Deep fakes are extremely problematic and can do real world harm. In India, videos have been a dangerous medium of disinformation. Cropped or out of context videos have already led to loss of lives. Deep fakes are no longer a dystopian future. They are very much here and we should all be concerned. 